Hi guys, it's Miss Lisa and I'm back on the porch and I'm saying a special hello to Emmy, Robert, and Ryan who wanted to know if I had the book Silly Sally, which I used to have, um, but when I used to own a child care center, some of those books got lost along the way. So I know it in my head and I think the song, um, Silly Sally, Silly Sally, Sally went to town, Silly Sally, Silly Sally, backwards, upside down. And so once my library opens again, I can go get a copy and read it especially for you guys but for today I have a book that I don't know if you know this book it is called purple hair I don't care and it's by Diane Young and Barbara Hartman I think you're gonna really like this it's one of those books that's kind of um, has a surprise purple hair I don't care one of the first Hints of the surprise is the first sentence. Mrs. Della Raggin went to see old Dr. Gray. She'd been feeling kind of funny in a funny kind of way. He checked her up and he checked her down. He checked her toe to head. Then he took her by the hand and this is what he said. There's a baby in your belly. How exciting, Della shrieked. Just a minute there now, Della. I'm not finished. Let me speak. There's a baby in your belly, and it might have purple hair. Purple hair? I don't care. I'll love my little baby anyway. But there's more, the doctor said. There's a baby in your belly, and it might have skin of green. Skin of green? I think that's keen. Purple hair? I don't care. I'll love my little baby anyway. But there's more, the doctor said. There's a baby in your belly, and it might have pointed ears. Pointed ears? No cause for tears. Skin of green? I think that's keen. Purple hair? I don't care. I love my little baby anyway. But there's more, the doctor said. There's a baby in your belly, and it might have yellow eyes. Yellow eyes? No need for size. Pointed ears? No cause for tears. Skin of green? I think that's keen. Purple hair? I don't care. I love my little baby anyway. Do you see some of the pictures at the top? Skin of green, yellow eyes, purple hair. But there's more, the doctor said. There's a baby in your belly and it might have breath that's smoky. Breath that's smoky? Okie dokie. Yellow eyes, no need for size. Pointed ears, no cause for tears. Skin of green, I think that's keen. Purple hair, I don't care. I love my little baby anyway. But there's more, the doctor said. There's a baby in your belly and it might have wings of blue. Wings of blue? Well, whoop-dee-doo. Breath that's smoky, okie dokie. Yellow eyes, no need for size. Skin of green, I think that's keen. Pointed ears, no cause for tears. Purple hair, I don't care. I love my little baby anyway. But there's more, the doctor said. Hold it, doctor, Della sputtered. Please don't tell me any more. I'm already so excited I might faint and hit the floor. But Della, aren't you worried, he carried on to say, that your baby will be frightful? Don't be silly, Dr. Gray. There's a baby in my belly and it might have purple hair. I don't care. Skin of green? I think that's keen. Pointed ears? No cause for tears. Yellow eyes? No need for size. Breath that smoky? Okie dokie. Wings of blue? Well, whoop-dee-doo. And don't you fret. I won't turn pale if you tell me there's a tail. Oh, to you it might seem frightful, but to me it sounds delightful, and I'll love my little baby, come what may. Are you sure now, asked the doctor? Poor half-blind old Dr. Gray. That's important. I will say it one more time. Are you sure now, asked the doctor? Poor half-blind Dr. Gray. Yes, I'm sure, said Della Raggin.
Then she winked and flew away. <laughs> Purple hair, I don't care, and I hope you liked today's porch time story time, and I'll be back for a couple more. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.